This is Alex Peace of the States Gazette reporting at the first day of MIPIM UK where, despite the rather inclement weather, the first round of protesters has already arrived. It's on a much smaller scale than last year, though it's early doors yet, and what they're really protesting about is the social injustice they see in London's housing supply. There's been a redesignation of what used to be brownfield sites, which meant, used to mean like industrial estates that were going to be knocked down and made available for new housing. Instead of that, now there's been a redesignation of existing housing, like council flats, that are now considered brownfield sites. So low density places are being knocked down and replaced with high density. So rather than increasing the stock of housing, they're basically taking over things that have already got rail links, that have got transport links because it's cheaper and it doesn't increase the housing stock. So it's more money for them, but doesn't improve housing. Despite the currently small turnout, there are a number of different groups protesting, from unions and residents to political parties. When asked what their response was to the fact that developers have actually provided a billion pounds in affordable housing payments since 2010, they said... It should be a lot more than that. I mean, you look at places like the Earl's Court redevelopment around the corner, they're getting 11% affordable housing out of a site that used to contain thousands of council homes. Um, there's something like 79 new social homes being built on that site, and that's not good enough. We can do better. The developers can survive on lower profits. Uh, we can strike better deals than, uh, than what Boris Johnson is doing at the moment. At the moment, he's overriding some councils who try and get a better deal and calling in developments and letting them go through with much less affordable housing than London needs. It's all about what London needs, not about the profits of the development. The organisers of MIPIM UK are mindful of the UK's affordable housing issues, but are keen to stress that this is a conference to generate more investment into London. I mean, we are very mindful of, of the importance of affordable housing in the UK and, and in London, and you know we respect the, the right uh, of indi individuals to protest. I think MIPIM UK, well, which is now the biggest gathering uh, of real estate players in the UK with 4,000 people, uh, brings a platform from real estate players from throughout the UK, not London only, but also the regions. And I think that's what uh, international investors have been asking us for a couple of years and we finally have this. For the moment, the demonstrations remain muted with police outnumbering protesters, but they are raising an important objection to the fact that despite London's development boom, more and more people are slipping through the cracks.